brought my best friend Lucy her favorite flowers. Sunflowers, right Lucy? These are your favorite type of flowers. Just like me, Vincent Van Gogh gave his best friend, Paul Gauguin, sunflowers. But instead of giving him actual sunflowers, he painted sunflowers. Vincent Van Gogh was from the Netherlands, but he was living in Arles, France. He was really, really lonely. So he invited his best friend, Paul Gauguin, to come down and paint with him and live in the yellow house. Before Paul arrived, Vincent Van Gogh painted several pictures of sunflowers to hang up in Paul's room. Upon his arrival, Paul did not like the sunflower paintings. Little did he know that several years later that those paintings would go for millions of dollars. Let's take a look at Vincent Van Gogh's sunflower paintings. What do you notice? Do you see that some flowers are alive and that others are dead? Perhaps Van Gogh was trying to represent the stages of life. Today, we are going to be like Vincent Van Gogh and paint sunflowers. And perhaps when you are done with your sunflower painting, you can give it to your best friend. We will make our own Vincent Van Gogh sunflowers using a black crayon and watercolor paints. Use the black crayon to draw the sunflowers. Draw a base and a table. Next, draw the sunflowers. It will help if you can look at actual sunflowers when you are creating your still life. After you are done drawing the flowers, add the stems and remember that Vincent Van Gogh signed his name right on the vase. Next, use your watercolors to paint your picture. Remember, the crayon will resist the watercolor. Use yellow to paint the flowers and choose any color you want for the base, table, and background. I'm going to paint my background blue. And I'm going to paint my table orange. Here is my Van Gogh sunflower creation. Who will you give your sunflower painting to?